Welcome to Earth 2050, where we take a look into possible technological advancements that are predicted by futurists from around the world. If you haven't already, I suggest you listen to this with headphones and get comfortable. These predictions were taken from the site 2050.earth if you'd like to know more. Now, let us begin. Satellites as new drones. By the year 2040, a huge amount of new micro satellites will be in orbit and traveling through our solar system. This system, critical for Earth and intersolar system communications, gains new attention for our satellite hackers, not only to control and sniff on communications, but also to abuse the system to control connected devices and the satellites themselves. 80% of homes are served by robots. Technological development is following the path of man's liberation from household slavery. Robot Chef prepares your meal with the help of such devices as 3D print microwaves. It also orders food from stores daily or weekly, following a list that you have compiled. Cleaning duties rests with mini drones. They not only collect dust and litter, but also carry out hygiene UV treatment of kitchen countertops, bathrooms, and your toilet. The abundance of technology with elements of AI does not confuse anyone. The entire team of personal household robots, thoroughly tested by manufacturers and services in terms of protection of external cyber attacks. The more home robots you have, the more opportunities you have to focus on the human side of your existence. Home Energy Exchange Electricity customers located in the same apartment or belonging to the same owner can exchange energy accumulated in their batteries through direct communication with each other. For example, at some point it may be more efficient to spend the energy accumulated in the car battery rather than evolve uh, rather to involve the electrical grid. A smart house can request the permission from the parked car, which in turn consults its owner's electronic calendar and can determine what amount of electricity should be left in reserve if any trips are planned for today. Theft and deceit of a virtual assistant. The development of neural networks has allowed mankind to reconsider computing. Neuromorphic computers that imitate the work of a human nervous system have emerged. They store and process data using the same elements and the capabilities of such computer are determined by the data set fed to it. The emergence of these computers has brought about unprecedented opportunities. Now everyone can get one's own digital entity, a personal assistant that owns all the data about a person collected since birth. Think of it as a kind of digital self. Such an entity can make decisions on behalf of the owner because it acts the same way as the owner so that people have started to delegate many routine issues to their digital avatars. An interesting feature of a neuromorphic computer consists an impossibility to run malware. It can be cheated in two ways only. First is to steal the entire system, basically making a copy, and thus learning all there is to there is to know about the person, including how he or she will behave in a given situation. And number two is to give the wrong data set to the avatar. Neural network underlying the digital essence draws upon the data set 
while making decisions, which is in fact the past of the person. If this data set is substituted, the neural network will make decisions that, that isn't typical of the person, thus a virtual entity that is, for example, often used for business negotiations can make a decision that a person would never make. But as it is considered a full-fledged representative of the person, in fact, to some extent, it can be regarded as the person, its decision has the same power as its owner. By 2030, cars will communicate with each other during your ride. Vehicles are connected to form a single network and are in constant interaction. This allows you to carry out all kinds of maneuvers quickly and safely, such as overtaking, changing lanes, and turning. Thanks to this coordinated information exchange, traffic congestions and jams are greatly reduced. Cars can ride as close as inches from each other which saves space on the road and energy by each car riding in each other's wind draft. Of course, such complex computer network that determines people's safety needs 100% protection against cyber attacks with the most qualified specialist working in this field. Very soon, we'll have ball-shaped wheels in cars. This solution will allow a significant increase in maneuverability and diagonal parking will finally become a pleasure. Most importantly, a spherical wheel, which is kept in a magnetic field, simplifies the construction of the suspension to a great extent, thus making it more reliable and durable. By 2040, smart lenses will be the new normal. All existing gadgets, smart watches, phones, fitness trackers, and other devices are unified according to their functions and features in a single device. Besides, such a device has additional functions such as transmitting images to the retina of the user and also provide sense for smell. The work of this single communication device eventually becomes dependent only on the energy of the human body and does not require any additional method of charging. The unified communications device is implanted in the form of a chip in the human body and you will no longer need pockets to hold things such as a wallet or a phone. By 2040 or even sooner, it will have become fashionable to have one's own intellectual drone that functions as a personal assistant. It always follows the owner at a comfortable distance, can take fit, uh, pictures and shoot videos, send and receive personal email, call the police or doctor if the owner is in danger, or function even as a courier. Personal drones accumulate a lot of confidential information and are able to influence the physical security of their owners so that people should be encouraged to give special and very close attention to the cyber defense system of their intelligent drones. By 2050, the sleeping process in dreams will finally be studied deep enough to enable complete control over them. Lucid dreaming and programmable dreams are a very handy thing. As you know, people can learn being inside of a dream, as well as watch movies, read books, travel to other countries, and even other worlds. And it doesn't take much time at all. With this, adware, malware for lucid dreams, will push advertising into dreams so that people won't remember viewing it, but this memory from a dream is guaranteed to work out when a person chooses the product. By 2050, almost every inhabitant of the Earth will have at least one biotech implant 
or implanted microchip. Computers will have taken the size of contact lenses. Now to find a necessary media file, it is enough to just look at the file and blink, and the media will feed directly into your visual and auditory nerves. This will open up a broad, wide variety of prospects, not only in entertainment, but also in education, information exchange, and business. I hope that you enjoyed this predictive look into the future of humanity. And again, if you want to read more predictions from futurists about this, then I will provide a link to the website below in the description.